Alright, so this video we are taking a look at the cheapest 4K gaming PC that you can get right now for around $1300 because there is a huge sale in the GPU with the i5-13500 and the AMD RX 6950 XT but there is a slight catch. So hey, if you wanted to get into 4K gaming for really budget friendly price, $1300 will give you that. So let's get to the benchmarks and the first game that we're looking at is Hogwarts Legacy, the brand new game, a 4K ultra settings ray tracing set to medium and FSR set to performance we were getting around 60 frames per second there's a lot going on there but yeah this is still ray tracing capable GPU next up we got Call of Duty Warzone and at 1080p with ultra settings we are getting around 165 to 170 FPS and this is the same frame rates that you could get from something like the i5 13600k next up we got God of War and at 4k ultra settings we were getting around I believe 75 to 80 frames per second and this is around like you know uh, the highest settings that you can go out of this game and i said it's gonna be an i5-13500 but the i5-13500 is a disappointing cpu once paired with ddr4 ram so yeah we went with the second best thing compared to the 13600k actually which is the intel core i7 12700kf this cpu goes for around 275 dollars and it performs around the same of the i5-13600k at 4k you know once paired with something like an rtx 4090 and the gpu that we have here isn't anywhere near the uh, the rx 4090 so you're not getting any bottleneck even if you decided to go down to 1440p and yeah it gives you really great value for money when it comes to the cpu intensive benchmarks it gives you really great value for money when it comes to gaming and the pc will hold it just fine and the board will look at a not you know overclockable uh board but we are looking at a b660m-g i think pro from msi this one goes for 100 dollars it's got all the bells and whistles it supports our cpu out of the box it's got only two ram slots but this is as much as what we need actually yeah and it will get the job done and the ram we're looking at 216 gigs ddr4 3200 megahertz ram uh so it totals to 32 gigabytes this is a 4k gaming pc so it makes a lot of sense to go with 32 gigabytes so which brings us to the ssd a team group one terabyte m.2 ssd you know so we're getting the extra space for a sata ssd or even a pcie 4.0 ssd which brings us to the gpu and we're looking at a huge sale on the rx 6950 xc this goes for 660 dollars right now on amazon so please please if you're not even getting the pc get this gpu because this is a great deal i mean this gives you around the same performance of the rtx 4070 ti for 140 dollars less so you're actually getting what you're paying for or even more this makes up for a really good value for money amd has returned back when it comes to supporting uh, the, their gpus with the latest drivers you know a latest driver just dropped recently and it's got 16 gigabytes of vram this gpu is a great deal in my opinion you couldn't even find it used for that price on ebay so there isn't much to say here i love this gpu and the case we're looking at something that it's on sale to the fractal design case that goes for 70 dollars that's got two rgb fans out of the box and it looks really good in black and white themed which is the same theme you know of our pc so yeah it really gets the job done and yeah i would like you to have it actually and the power supply we're looking at i believe a corsair cx 750 m so this is a 750 watt 80 plus bronze certified semi-modular power supply that will get the job done you can add you know custom sleeved cables to make it a black and white gaming pc also the cpu cooler is a thermal take assassin cpu cooler so you're getting all what you need so yeah you can also go with any case you want to go with and that's been it if you like the video press on that like button if you want to see more of that kind subscribe and i'll see you in the next one peace